What is, what is... Paulo and Hiki Machado share some of his most cherished memories. Images of a life spent here in this room, mostly confined to his bed, for 43 years. Paulo and Hiki is paralyzed from the waist down. He breathes with the help of a respirator. As an infant, he contracted polio and was sent to live in the hospital. Some of those years in the dreaded iron lung, like these. It was the 1970s before vaccines eradicated polio in Brazil. That's Pedro. Back then, it was him and me. We were very close. He was my best friend. Children with serious infections were sent to the Clinicas Hospital in Sao Paulo, with little hope of survival. There were nine of them here with Paulo and Hiki. His mother had died two days after he was born. The rest of his family soon stopped coming to see him. The polio ward was his home, the staff and fellow patients, his family. It was a wonderful time. I'll never forget it. Even though most of our friends are no longer with us, I never stopped dreaming about them. Over the years, many died, including his best friend, Pedro. It was December 26, the day after Christmas. Everything I'd planned with my friend, life, didn't have the same meaning, but it made me stronger. Two people survived, Paulo and Hiki and his lifelong friend and roommate, Eliana Zaghi. We are like brother and sister, and we look after each other. Eliana suffered paralysis caused by polio when she was a baby. She's lived in the hospital for 38 years. I've been here since I was one year and nine months old. I learned to write, to paint, to use a cell phone, a computer, things I like. They were both encouraged to push beyond their physical limitations. Eliana discovered painting, patiently dabbing at the canvas with a brush taped to a tongue depressor. The wear and tear on her teeth meant she had to limit herself, but she hasn't stopped. Paulo and Hiki trained as a computer animator and is now working on a cartoon about his life with the help of crowdfunding. Dr. Nuno da Silva has worked in the ICU since 1988. He says Paulo and Hiki and Eliana are inspirations. We've had young patients that we've taken to their room. They're examples to show that it isn't the end of the world. Paulo and Hiki's biggest passions are movies and video games opportunities to escape his own world. I like to live outside my reality. To get out of reality, I play games. In the games, I can go where I want without suffering pain. He tells us that soon video games are going to take him out into the real world. A rare trip outside the hospital walls to visit a video game convention. A trip we don't want to miss. Shasta Darlington, CNN, Sao Paulo.